Oh, right. So, good check, morning. Good morning. <laughs> check the timestamp. This is real. Uh, welcome to Reels on Wheels. I am Justin. This is Irene. And the, today we are going to see Infinity War. Welcome to the season premiere of Reels on Wheels. That's wow. right. <laughs> yes. And we are up early. Uh, we are dedicated. We are doing this for you, but mostly for us. Yeah. We, we, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we have to get ahead of this. I don't want to run into any spoilers. Yeah. You've been running into spoilers, so what's 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 the deal? What is your, um, are you excited? Are you, eh? I feel like I'm going to be running the the gamut of emotions here. Of, of like, from hopefulness to excitement to, like, mm -hmm. what? You know? Mm -hmm. So, I'm, I'm, but I want that. I want, yeah. I want my world <laughs> to be destroyed. Because this is 10 years in the making. Mm -hmm. This is a special event. I'm excited, but I'm also very nervous. What about you? But like nervous in a good way. Okay. Yeah, what okay. about you? Um, I think we might be in a similar boat. Okay. Um, the hype has been real. Yeah. I've uh, purposely removed myself. Like I didn't even watch the trailer again. It wa um, The trailer popped up while I was watching tv and okay. i was like oh right yeah that's that's what's going on it's oh, just i've been okay. so excited i haven't read anything yeah i haven't heard anything so so you're kind of downplaying it um because you're like oh that trailer for that thing I'm well gonna see. because i'm so excited <laughs> yeah you know yeah. because i don't want it to be like i'm so hyped and then when, when i finally see it it's like oh yeah it's oh, okay really? you think that I will mean, happen is re it's insane right yeah. i don't yeah. know no i think i think i'll be pretty happy with it I'm already expecting to be wowed, so yeah. I already know I'm gonna like it. I completely stayed away from everything. Whoa, taking my approach. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I am because I mean <laughs> this is a big deal. You know, this is going to be a uh, a, spo a non-spoiler review, and then we'll do something special later to spoil the movie. Or to talk in detail with you if you've already seen it. Yeah. Well, or if you have no interest in seeing it, you right. can get the scoop from us. Yeah. And the thing is, the reason why we wanted to do that is because, you know, we wanted to give people time to soak this up. Uh, and which, ourselves, Yes. Too. And ourselves, yes. So you will be getting our initial reaction uh, of seeing Infinity War, but we won't, mm -hmm. like, like just mouth spoil everything it's gonna be hard for me because to me any kind of review is a spoiler to some degree for me i'm such a purist that way yeah, like yeah. If, if i'm really interested in seeing a movie i don't even want to know how you felt about it because if i know you a little bit i'm gonna have a feeling of what it was like you know even when people joke like oh and so di so and so died oh i'm not really spoiling anything well, you, you did because because just you saying that means that they didn't die, you know? Yeah, and I'm talking in general here. Yeah, 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 for sure. So even joke spoilers, it's a spoiler in itself. Yeah. Uh, so I, uh, I'm i going to try my best okay. to speak in general terms. Generalizations. Maybe we can uh, focus on themes. Yeah, yeah. And These then are I, more notes for myself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then I figured, yeah. I figured after we review it, you yeah. know, if you want to go have breakfast, because it is morning time, we can talk at length yeah, yeah. Uh, together about it off camera off camera you know yeah. but um yeah. so that's kind of our idea we thought this is such a special premiere for reels on wheels for um a story that's uh liter i mean it's 10 years in the making like how do you feel about that like um this this movie is definitely epic and um even to the naysayers who don't care about the marvel sure. franchise at all they can't deny that um Marvel, Disney Marvel has created something really special here and yeah. they've invested in their characters and their movies to even make this possible. Um, I can't think of any other franchise no. who has done that successfully right, or yeah. even attempted it. Unprecedented! <laughs> there you go. No, it is because even if you think of like a, a character that's been in movies for mm -hmm. longer than these movies have been coming out, like think James Bond, they're not telling one story over the 24 movies James You're Bond right. it's has. like a retelling it's just a retelling that or just that time. It, yes exactly this uh since 2008 has been like even if they weren't sure they were going to do it or not since Iron Man they were like yeah let's 
let's uh, throw in this Avengers ID and see where we go. I've been like reflecting actually yeah. all week on like where I was when I saw yeah. Iron Man, the kind of person I was when I saw okay. Iron oh, Man. Wow. And you know, We're deep. well, over <laughs> 10 years, your tastes yeah. change. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And these movies, uh, you know, I was like in my mid 20s when I saw when when this whole thing started. And um, it's just like, you know, yeah, that's really, weird to think about. Not that it's like, you know, where was I on, <laughs> on right, day? No, day, no. But <laughs> not I mean, at all, but. as you know, as a uh, cinephile and just, you know, a movie mm -hmm. lover, it's it's just the scope is huge. And I think that's, yeah. you know, why we were like, let's go to 6.30 a.m. show. As you said, Marvel and Disney invested time. Um, so did we. And like, mm -hmm, we want to mm -hmm. be rewarded. Yeah. And I, well said. I think they'll deliver but I think they will too yeah I'm just um, you know I'm just like the, I don't think I'm ready <laughs> <laughs> the, yeah. you know the one thing that always worries me about these kind of ensemble sure. movies there's yeah. a lot of people to deal with yeah um, many movies have tried yes uh but I think uh, they're the best people to do it yeah. If anybody else was doing it, I'd be really worried. But even even then, I'm like, oh, that that might be a concern. But yeah, um, I think they'll handle it well. Plus, we have two more movies after this, or one more. Oh, this uh, in this phase. Yeah. Um, I think we have. That's how two. far removed I am from it. Okay, I so we okay, still yes, have Ant Man and the two. Wasp, and then Captain Marvel. So there's more. There, well, untitled, more. yeah, untitled yeah. Avengers, whatever, whatever do, it's gonna be. Do you think we'll see everybody? Like, do you even think we'll see Ant Man at all? I don't know. If he has his movie coming out. Well, yeah, that's the thing because we were trying to figure that out, and I'm like, you know what? At least Ant Man's alive. Yeah, they did say that insects can survive the, the apocalypse, right? So maybe when all that stuff was going down, he's like, okay, let's go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let's just lay really low. Yeah. The last couple of movies have been really strong. Um, Black Panther. Oh my god. Thor Ragnarok. Yeah. Uh, Homecoming. Right oh yeah, you're rocking your Ooh, bling. All my pins. We That's got, awesome. We I look Avengers. like I'm going to work. <laughs> you are going to work, Justin. That's true. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I was uh, chatting with somebody who had just gotten out of the theater like an hour ago. Oh, really? So... Yeah. And they were that, like, mouth He was garbage. really kind <laughs> and oh, just that's said, nice. I just got out. We'll talk about it later. I was like, yeah. Wow. Thank you. And that was me. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 Are you excited for uh, Josh Brolin's yeah. Thanos? Yeah. You know, he's having a pretty damn say, good year. Right? Uh, last couple of years, actually. I mean, he's sort of... Uh, been this kind of cool character actor yeah. and now he's taking on this um the ultimate bad guy like the ultimate bully <laughs> um so what a dick yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah right um, Jeez, that, yeah. that's a lot of pressure for him i mean yeah. uh that is one criticism marvel has gotten just uh the bad guy the department bad guys I feel like they're on a really good like finally figured it out yeah well, yeah <laughs> 10 years took them, 10 years. Took them long Jeez. enough i don't know sun's coming sun's up big cool. guy <laughs> so yeah we're we're gonna go <laughs> we're gonna go see uh avengers infinity war yeah and we will come back we will try our best to keep it general keep it general no and deets. then and express our thoughts and then we'll probably yeah. go grab some, a coffee or breakfast and, and maybe a coffee i've already had bro uh oh. disclosure like this is um this is right on par with my day i usually get up at three or four in the morning cool like cool. a psycho so yeah it was hard for me <laughs> Justin's but not a morning i'm guy. dedicated it's okay when he's here to infinity war and beyond <laughs> okay, so we are back from seeing Avengers Infinity War. It's a lot to unpack. Uh, we are going to do our uh, due diligence and, and, and try our best not to spoil the movie. Our first spoil-free review, or the best that we can do. Yes. What did you think of Avengers Infinity War? Uh, I loved it. Right out the gate. Yeah. Loved it. They, you could tell they... Uh, worked very hard to craft 
a good story and mm -hmm. to manage the different settings yeah um and plot lines how about you if you're like watching this right now and you're like wow they look kind of exhausted there's a reason for that it but it's like a good exhausted yeah. the movie itself is almost three hours long previously when i was talking about running the gamut of emotions it did oh, just that it really did we were excited uh we were uh laughing we were happy we were heartbroken we were humbled by the whole thing and it delivered on every possible way it could it really did i mean for all the hype it had i was thinking about uh while watching, I'm like, man, well, when everybody starts teaming up, um, yeah. I was thinking of a metaphor. You know how you just keep saving money in your bank, if you're being good about it, sure. saving money, yeah. and then you have that one huge awesome purchase or investment, and then it just all pays off because you've been working so hard? That's what Marvel has done over yeah. the last decade. You see it just pay back in returns, just watching the characters that we've invested in invested in yeah over the past 10 years and finally meet each other and have their personalities yeah. and characters play off of each other so effortlessly it yeah. was like beautiful let's talk about the structure you mentioned yeah. uh you know certain characters being broken off into teams that was a very clever uh storytelling device <laughs> earlier you said you know it's an unprecedented cast like how can they juggle and balance so many you know, big stars and, and characters and egos. Mm -hmm. And like right from the jump, it was seamless. Yeah. It's just so brilliantly done. It's a, Is it a science? They figured out like, okay, we can take this yeah. much time with this scene. And then when that beat happens, throw it to them. And they do it in a way where before they uh, transition to another scene, you're then thinking about it like, oh yeah, I wonder... Hey, there we are. Yeah, We're yeah. Right back there. Yeah. And it, you never you never lose interest. No. Watching anything that's unfolding. That's huge for a, a almost 3-hour movie. Your eyes are glued to the screen. So on on a storytelling level and a way of balancing these characters, um they excelled, mm -hmm. you know? Very well done. Um, what did you think of Josh Brolin? The whole time I was thinking about how um, how well done of a villain he is. How yeah, he, his motivation. You actually feel for him. You feel kind and of bad. In, for better or worse, you understand his plan and mm -hmm. why he's doing it. Yeah. Maybe not exactly why. I wonder what his. Maybe we'll explore that. He definitely has many layers. I kept thinking of uh, Justice League, Steppenwolf, oh, sure, and yeah. how just terribly one dimensional compared to. The many layers of Thanos that we're getting here. Josh Brolin was fantastic. You can mm -hmm. hear his, uh, you know, you hear his voice. Oh, you see his eyes. You see his eyes. His expressions. He was a real yeah. solid character that mm -hmm. was there. I think he takes the, I mean, he has to. He takes the cake as far as Marvel villains go. These Marvel movies having a villain problem, um, it almost feels like they made some of these other villains one-dimensional with the exception of a few uh because they put all their efforts into crafting this mm -hmm. thanos character who is terrifying the ultimate big bad every time he's on screen i'm like <laughs> terrified <laughs> yeah i am yeah. nervous would you say you'd have to see all the movies beforehand to no. to to get a sense of um of this story? No, no, okay. definitely you not. Say no? I think they um I think they do a great job of touching really quickly uh who everyone is. If if you haven't seen Guardians though, I feel it yeah. might be a little random, the Guardians of the Galaxy. You know what? I was very impressed with how the Russo brothers took James Gunn's world yeah. of Guardians of the Galaxy and put them in the the Avengers. Yeah. I was I was kind of nervous. I'm like, will there will it feel like our guardians, the ones we know? And they did a very oh awesome job of integrating the guardians of the galaxy the banter into with 
yeah. with the humor. With the humor is very good. We get a lot of, as heavy as it is, we get a lot of light moments with the humor between yeah. some of the characters. So you say no on seeing yeah. all the movies. And I actually say yes. Okay. You need to see all these movies because it leads up to such a very enjoyable cinematic experience. Oh yeah, I mean if you want to fully enjoy it. That's a good point Phase though. We, we yeah. are very invested so yeah. it is, yeah, yeah. Like um, do you need to see all these movies? Kinda. Yeah, to fully understand, to fully the, understand uh, and, the gravity mm -hmm, of this. Yes, and appreciate what Marvel has done. To tell this story up to this point, I'll say that. But there was enough exposition though where there were moments where I was kind of sitting back going, oh, right, we're, like, filling people in who haven't been around right. for some reason for yeah. the past ten years. I get it. And that didn't even feel like exposition. It just felt just natural because certain characters had to know. Right. Because if you think about it, some of these characters have never met. Um, met <laughs> or have heard of each other. Or have been, uh, <laughs> you know, or have been uh, away. They tie everything together wonderfully. Mm -hmm. Man, there's a lot of action in this movie, there's too. I'm just, like... Reliving it all. So, yeah. I, what more can we talk about without... What, what else do you want to explore? Would you watch it again? Yeah. Oh, yeah, most definitely. <laughs> yeah. Uh, when the credits rolled, mm -hmm. and all of the credits rolled, um, I thought about my, my, my older brothers, mm -hmm. and I'm like, they're going to love this movie because they've been, watch they've been reading comics since they were little mm -hmm. kids. And even my friend Anthony, I messaged him right away, and I said, dude, your jaw's going to drop. This is a Marvel Comics fan's, like, wet dream. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's how uh, simpatico you know, we are. No. I'm, I'm very happy for the people who ha are, have invested their time even before these movies. That have read the Good Infinity point. Gauntlet story. That have grew up uh, reading the comics of Jack Kirby and Stan Lee and all this stuff. I'm excited to show... Jeff, my husband, who is very far removed from these movies. Yes. He wouldn't go see them if I didn't drag him over yeah. to it. And he's always a good sport. He always enjoys it. He always enjoys it when I take him, but Yeah. Um I Same think he's with really, Nicole. Yeah, she's I the think, same way. I think his jaw's gonna drop. I don't know. What do you think? Yeah. Do you think Nicole will be I'm excited to watch this with Nicole because I'm shocked at this. I'm I think of all the <laughs> Yeah, I think of all the movie like we watch a lot of movies together and the whole time she's like, Wait, well, who's that again? What's that? At least with these movies, she knows because mm -hmm. she's sort of... That's how pervasive the Marvel Universe yeah, is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, and she's kind of uh, been around the comics world because of, mm -hmm. you know, what I do. So I think she's excited. I mean, she she's not as excited as, as we were. Um, but she she's a good but, sport. Yeah, no, she's totally, totally. <laughs> yeah, uh, what a way to kick off the summer For movie real, season. real, right? Yes. Well, I mean, I mean, Black Panther, probably. Yeah, yeah. That. Well, that came out in February. I know, I'm talking but like you know. summer. Yeah, movies. no, you're right, right. Yeah. But I feel like they keep pushing back the summer dates. So you're on notice, movies that are coming out this yeah. summer. Good luck. <laughs> yeah. I give this a massive reel. Like huge. An infinity gauntlet. Oh, like a bunch of them. Do we have a gauntlet with all the wheels all the reels oh yeah you should just have like a huge one <laughs> and it's got the one. yeah it like washed so, over uh, us i think we're still processing yeah for sure yeah. and uh you know thank you for letting us do that here sort of dissect the movie get it out of our system let everyone have a chance to go see this uh amazing movie and then we will do a uh, very special spoiler filled edition of reels on wheels and by that you should have seen it already right you know don't let this get spoiled for you um, avoid avoid life. as <laughs> you know it's a good time it is a good time there's there's laughing there's laughing you know it is very much uh wrath of khan empire strikes back see i know star wars but um yeah it's got that sort of um i said wrath of khan and empire strikes back oh okay okay yeah <laughs> <laughs> you thought you you thought you tripped me up i mean it leaves you wanting more but it, it also want makes you kind of sit with this and be like I'm I think I'm good for a while like I don't need to know when the next Marvel thing is you know yeah we have a lot to chew on yeah exactly for reels on wheels this has been Justin and Irene thanks for joining us Bye. make sure to subscribe and comment reels on wheels forever <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, I keep doing that oh, on what? camera. <laughs> like, that makes it better. <laughs> just as a ceiling that I just want to keep pushing. Just bust it through. Bust through the ceiling. 